So guys, are you awkward? I don't know, but I may be awkward. But anyways, we'll go in as a Gemini Man. Uh, okay, what I like about Gemini Man stage is that the music. Look at the music. It sounds like an anime music. Look at that. It's like a theme song. For like Spider-Man or something. It's like, here comes Gemini Man. Here comes Gemini Man. Here. Yeah, it's probably not the lyrics though, but you know, it's still pretty decent lyrics. Whoa, those are two. Now you can actually just like go like yeah, breeze through the stage pretty easily. Uh, there's something stuck in my throat right now, and like I want to like cough, but like my body won't let me. I don't know if like that ever happened to you guys before, but that's, whoa, that's amazing. Yeah, I don't know if that happened to you guys before, but that's really weird. Like I just need to cough right now. It's like that thing like when you have not to sneeze, then you say broccoli, and all of a sudden like no one like you're not to sneeze if you don't sneeze. You know, it's one of those, like, mysteries in life, and, you, and then you, like, you tend to ask gods, like, why did that just happen? Whoa, you're not about to die. Yeah, stand next to the flame of death. Oh, wow! I think this is where we left off, I'm not sure. Um, let's see, go here, then kill that. See, they're all one shot with their little unchargeable mega buster. And you can kill this. But the penguin is in one shot though, and it like, its attack is like dropping eggs. I mean, maybe that's where you got that idea from Super Mario Brothers 2. Now, which one came first? Brothers 2 or Mega Man 3? You know, we'll have to check the date on that. Whoa, how did I hit him? Yo, eggs. Since when did penguins store their eggs? Don't they take care of them first? Whoa. You know that music, that's Proto Man's music. Hopefully, yeah, we don't fight him. I don't think so. Anyways, before you want to go down here, you want to hold left. See if I can do it, because there's a 1 up here, and you want to get that 1 up. And you can get that by doing this. There we go. Up, up. See, it's one way or another. Now, this, this part of the level is like one of my favorites. It's like, you break off the egg, and then all of a sudden, you know, like little sperm babies come in. Like, watch. Hold on. See, th those are those have to be sperm. Come on, these are the eggs and those are the sperm, right? Anyways, these these little eggs drop a lot of things, so like... Like, go haywire them, and they don't even do that much damage. I think it's like two for every one. You can get, like, every once in a while, they'll drop like a little healing thingy. Anyways, if you want to get this, be, be my guest and get this, but... You know, we really do not need it, unless you want to be like super lucky. And like get a E tank, but there's two E tanks already in the stage that we're gonna get, so we're just gonna skip that. It's probably gonna be like a little weapon recharger thing. You never know though. Should go probably check, but never mind. Now you wanna just like, go on the top right here and kill these. Well, you don't wanna kill that. No. Kill these bottom two, then just go up. So yeah, going up the ladder. And then we don't get to use any other weapons, so let's just skip that. And actually jump over that. Whoa. There it is. Dude! Are you kidding me? There it is. That's what I'm talking- Oh, why is he still alive? That happy face scares me. People who smile like that, like Ronald McDonald, scares the crap out of me. Okay, this is like the worst part of the stage. I hate this stage with like, with a passion. Like, I swear. See, it's because of those penguins. I get so much damage from this like, little laughing duck right here. And then the dragon flash, I can't even- I don't even know how to kill those. Like, they move too fast. Actually, I do know how to kill them, it's just that I suck at killing them. I'm just gonna use this, because he's, this is more powerful. Dude, is that ready? Nice. Uh, go down, dude. Yeah, I've been saying dude for Mega Man. Mega dude. Mega dude. That's not what you want to do. You want to get the trampoline out, because, you know, trampoline makes people jump higher. Oh! Oh, I thought it was a... There it is. Anyways. I've been really like addicted to Fantastic Fantasy 13. I didn't really get that far yet, like I play it, but then like I get tired of playing it, and then like sometimes I play it, and all of a sudden I get distracted with the with the computer and I'll go a game inform or something like that or game facts. But anyway, so we're gonna ride this, use your rush machine that you got from one of the bosses earlier, and there's the one up there. Cool. You wanna move as fast as you can here because because of like you might run out of stuff and like every every time you see like a rechargeable weapon thing you should actually go ahead and get it like this one because it drains out as soon as the thing and like if you're not in water you can actually jump on these and as soon as you're done just like switch out it's pretty easy pretty simple concept oh come on dude so how many times have i said dude like dude 
dude. It's like a little catchphrase now. Oh, that was pretty close. Okay, we want to keep on shooting. Here, and then shoot that, and then shoot this, and then get that, and then get that. Imagine that's like the whole commentary of like the whole game. That, shoot that, shoot that, dodge that, and dodge that. Ooh, come on. Man, it's like, it's like flying a spaceship. It is exactly like flying a spaceship, never mind. Now you want to dodge that, then good. As soon as you dodge it, you're good. Now, that's the second time that happened. Alright, I should be good now. <laughs> okay, we are safe. So we have four lives and two E-tanks right here. So jump up the ladder and make sure you don't die. And yeah, you know, you can just skip this. Okay, that's not skipping it. You can actually kill- Oh my god! Dude, dude, don't repeat- Oh! <laughs> Thought I was gonna die. Okay, okay. Now just leave. Die too. I could've just done that instead of going down and like losing like half of my life. Oh man. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. You equip this and then you can actually dodge this by doing that. And that's just, uh... Yeah, see that's- sometimes running away is way better than fighting. Not all the time though, not all the time. Now Gemini Man. See, Gemini means two, so you can actually just do this and use your snake search and kill both of them. Now, you have to hit them. Do okay, you want to sacrifice something? What the heck do you want to do, Mega Man? Uh, <coughs> 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 Alright, let's do that again. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that little transition of me coughing there because, you know, that's a really good segue. You know, it's like, achoo, achoo! Okay, let's try this again. Like, this time, let's not die. Went the wrong way, but hey, it hit him. You know, got, got the point done. Dude! Like, seriously? Wow, I had to stay quiet for that one because I was so confused and not what I was doing right now. And now I'm mumbling and, like, not even making sense at times. Oh man, I gotta admit you, the levels in Mega Man 3 are way longer than the patch that I played, like the 4, 5, 6, and the. Way, 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 way longer. Because the other ones are like 4 minutes, this one is like 6. Maybe that's because also that I die a lot. So that means... This is... Like... Designed for me to die or something like that. Anyways, we are going against... I think... I believe we're going against Hard Man. If not, we're going against Magnet Man for sure because Spark Man's power is weak to Magnet Man and... You know... Stuff like that does happen. And anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye. Look at Mega Man's eyes following him. He's gonna stalk you, and rape you, and possibly stab you. On the next episode.